Run, just a quick reminder before we get started that the, the vote for the next mini tournament will be held. Click on the link down below in the comment section and vote for which mini tournament you want to see next. It will either be an Earth tournament or a Lightning tournament. And without further ado, let's get on with this video. Hello everybody, this is Dreaming Up back to conclude the final of the Gracious Grass tournament. And yes, we have two matches here. The one that doesn't really matter, the fight for third place between Mutaburosaurus and Paris Tector. And then the one that actually matters. Parasaurolophus taking on Fukuisaurus. Will we, which one of these will be crowned the Gracious Grass Champion? Well, you're going to have to wait because we got the, the third place match to conclude first. So, let's get on with it. Okay, in the red corner we have the Mutaburosaurus. The Mutaburosaurus was mightily impressive in this tournament and has been impressive. That Venom, well, it's actually a decent move set. Actually, I gave it, yeah, pretty good. But the Burrosaurus has definitely racked up some impressive victories in this tournament. But this one would surpass them all. Because in the blue corner, we have Parapara Dinotector. Yeah, I also, I'd also like to ask a favour as well. I would like to know, is there a way I can edit out the music in this, in the, in the demo? So the... Da -da 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 that. Because I, I want to edit that out and put my own battle music in. And I only ask this is because I plan to do it when I do my big tournament. So I, I want to edit out that music there you can hear. But I want to keep obviously the sound effects of the dinosaurs roaring and attacking and such. I want to keep that bit but I want to remove the music. Now I have seen videos on YouTube and it has been done. I believe the... Um, Uh, the the um, the videos that showcase all the different dinosaurs, I believe that video has done it. So if anyone knows how I can do that, or what program I can use to do that, I'd be very grateful. But anyway, back to the match. And well, not much of a match, is it? Because the Paris Tector has just dispatched them at the Burrosaurus to take a 1-0 lead. Well, it was quick, wasn't it? Paris Tector making, trying to make up for losing in the semi-finals to the Fukui Swords by beating the crap out of Mutterborosaurus. But anyway, without further ado, let's move on to round two. Alrighty then, round two between these two. Can the can the Mutterborosaurus strike back, or will the Paris Tector continue to chip and chop away? Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, I should also mention that I, I know that we had a bit of a gap between the last Gracious Grass video and this one. That's, that's because I actually already recorded a Gracious Grass video, but the file got corrupted. Isn't that lovely? So I have to do it again. So I have to do it again. And and as a result, of that, I'm also the vote will also not last as long as it normally does. So this will probably go up the Monday. I record this. Well, the Monday after I record this. Well, it's the 2nd of September now. No, we're gone. So, I, so yeah, th this will go up Monday after after I finish my uh, Pachycephalosaurus week. And then the vote will close Friday, and hopefully the week after that, we can get started with whatever tournament you guys want to see. I have a feeling that it'll be a lightning tournament. I'm only doing it squeezing another tournament in, it's because when I do my main tournament, it's going to be a 3v3, and obviously, I'm going to have the champions team in it. And so far, we only have two new champions, the Sejuangosaurus and the... Oh, oh well, the winner of this tournament. So we need a third guy, and, well, that was a very quick third place match, wasn't it? The Paris Tech that definitely showing no mercy. Right, now, on to the match that actually matters, the Paris Aurolophus taking on the Fukui Saurus in the final. Okay then, in the final, in the red corner, we have a Parasaurolophus. The, the tournament favourite for many people in this here, and it's no surprise that it made it this far. But, it's going to be tough, because in the blue corner, we have the Parasaurolophus killer itself, the Fukui Saurus. And why I say it's a Parasaurolophus killer? Because it defeated the Super Para and it defeated Paris Tactic. 
In fact, the only Paris to run it won't fight is Paris. But, you know, it, that's because it was in a different bracket and Paris already lost. So we'll, we'll let Fukui Soros off the hook for that one. But can it take down the OG Paris? Well, not with a start like that. Parasaurolophus opens up with a hit. But the Emerald Garden has been triggered. And Emerald Garden has been key to Fukui Source's winning strategy. So I would be... I would be... I wouldn't be surprised if it, get, if it gets it off. Uh, oh no. And surprise, surprise, it gets off Emerald Garden. No surprise. Here comes the Emerald Garden, its signature move. The Green Ball of Death coming to suck the life out of the para. Blech. It's like a garden. Because it's Emerald Garden. <laughs> and just like that, the Queen Source turns it around. An intriguing start so far. Mm, but the para's gonna get a big hit. It's a defense first, it's a light recovery, and a metal wing. Fum, fum. Badoosh. Big damage dealt to the Fukui Source, and Emerald Garden was not triggered, so Fukui Source will not have the chance to heal up that health. That's a tie. Ties will favor the power though, because it does have more HP. And I think that is curtains for Fukui Saurus in the first round as another Metal Wing comes in to slice and dice. We haven't actually seen too much Metal Wingness from the Parasaurolophus. It's mainly been Defense First and Light Recovery doing all the work. But we definitely saw Metal Wing's potential there, defeating the Fukui Saurus and giving the Parasaurolophus a 1 0 lead. Oh, Edoki then. That, that was a good first round, and let's hope this upcoming round two will be just as good. Alrighty then, round two, a showdown on the beach. Well, a showdown by the seaside, I should say. But not really a seaside, it's a deserted seaside. But, back to the match, can the Fukui Saurus even the score, or can the Parasaurolophus continue to, well, win? Oh, here comes another Metal Wing. Parasaurolophus starting strong. Light Recovery will have to sit this one out though because her health is untouched. But the Defense Burst will definitely come into play, solidifying the Parasaurolophus' defenses. And no Emerald Garden as well. How costly could that be? That's a tie. Oh, oops, I clicked scissors. Ooh. A big hit coming from Fukui Saurus. Okay, this won't really matter. It, won't, it doesn't do that much damage. That much more damage. He splitty splitty splash. Blech. That could be a big moment in the match here. The Fukui Saurus getting off that egg attack. And now we're pretty much even. But the para does have the lead overall. So now the Fukui Saurus needs to win this match. And so far, the Fukui Source is winning this matchup. But yeah, look at that. The defensive resilience of the para there. Proving its worth. That's a tie. This time, ties favor the Fukui. However, has the Parasaurolophus just won it? Oh, almost! And the Emerald Garden! Well, it doesn't really matter at this point. The Fukui Source is going to kill it if it gets a hit. Or maybe not, actually. That light recovery may have just put the power just above the threshold. But any hit from the power will win it. And it is game over for the Fukui Source. The Parasaurolophus. Everyone's favourite greedy hadrosaur crested guy. Gal has won the Gracious Grass Tournament, and how ironic that she wins using Metal Whip, a move that was very prevalent in this final matchup, and a move that has defeated the Fukui Saurus and ends its killing streak of Paris at two. 
Well, 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 the Parasaurolophus. I believe I said in the semis that the Parasaurolophus' defensive might will just overcome the Fukuisaurus, and I was right. Although, I I did expect... I thought the Fukuisaurus would put up more of a fight there, but... Oh, well, the Parasaurolophus, one of the tournament favourites going into this, has won the Gracious Grass Tournament. <laughs> Golf clap. So let's give Parasaurolophus her 15 minutes of fame. Ooh, how many of you like Parasaurolophus? I'm sure I'm sure a lot of people will be happy with the winner of this tournament because Parasaurolophus is a very popular dinosaur. The favourite dinosaur of many people. Including, well, I'm not sure if it's still the case, but including the gaming beaver. So I'm sure if he was watching this, he'd be very proud. But yep, the Parasaurolophus has won the Gracious Grass Tournament. And her most gracious move was Metal Whip. So yeah, Parasaurolophus will join Sejuangosaurus in the champion in the Hall of Champions. And that will be it for the Gracious Grass Tournament. So I did you enjoy this tournament? I hope you enjoyed this tournament. Did your favourite win? I should I also commiserations to the Fukuisaurus as well, because it, it definitely did really well to get to the final and pulled up some impressive wins. And the the Parasaurus did well too. Even though I got slaughtered by the Paris Tector. But yeah, Parasaurolophus wins. How interesting. We've had the Spinosaurus, the Parasaurolophus, the Sejuangosaurus has won, and the Mapusaurus has won. That means that leaves... Well, we had the secret showdown where the... What, what? The Pachycephalus... Well, one of the Pachycephalosaurus has won. Who will win the next mini-tournament? Well, it, it'll depends, it depends on what it'll be. If it's an Earth tournament, will Cychenia win? Or if it's a Lightning tournament, will Staracosaurus win? You'll just have to have your say in the comment section below. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to make sure you don't miss out on the next mini tournament, which you lot will have a say in. And until then, this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.